What's up you guys, it's Scotty Bones 86 here with another exciting episode of Let's Play Metal Gear Solid Part 10. Dr. Clark was in charge. Dr. Clark? Yes. He started the gene therapy project. And where is he now? He was killed in an explosion in his lab two years ago. So what about this soldier? Apparently for their test subject, they decided to use the body of a soldier who was recovered after the fall of Zanzibar land. And that was Gray Fox. But he was already dead. Yes. <laughs> but they revived him. They fitted him with a prototype exoskeleton and kept him drugged for four years while they experimented on him like a plaything. Today's genome soldiers were born from those experiments. That's the sickest thing I've ever heard. They used him to test all sorts of gene therapy techniques. Naomi, why didn't you tell us about this sooner? Because it's confidential information. Is that the only reason? Naomi. What happened to Gray Fox after that? The record said he died in an accident. I see. But even if that ninja is Gray Fox, 
The question is, why? From what I could tell, he didn't know who he was. You're saying he's just living off his will to fight? I'm not sure, but he seems intent on fighting me to the death. We'll meet again. I know it. So you'll fight again? Until you kill him? Mm -hmm. I'd rather not. But maybe that's what he wants. stay in there. Huh? Are you one of them? No, I'm not. I always work alone. Alone? Are you an otaku too? Come on, get out. We can't stay here forever. Your uniform's different from theirs. You're the Metal Gear Rex Chief Engineer, Hal Emmerich, right? You know me? I heard about you from Merrill. Oh, so you're here to rescue me? Sorry, but no. There's something that I've got to do first. Oh, well, at least you're not one of them. purposes, of course. Liar. I already know that Metal Gear is nothing but a nuclear-equipped walking death mobile. Nuclear? What are you talking about? The terrorists are planning to use Metal Gear to launch a nuclear missile. You telling me you didn't uh, know? Aren't they just trying to use the TMD missile module to launch a disabled nuclear warhead? Wrong. From the beginning, the purpose of this exercise was to test Metal Gear's nuclear launch capability using a dummy nuclear warhead. The terrorists are just continuing the work you started. No, you're wrong. I heard it directly from your boss, Baker. No. A nuclear missile on Rex? So you really didn't know. No. All the armament was built by a separate department, and the president personally supervised the final assembly with the main unit. President Baker? Yeah. I was never told exactly what they armed Rex with. I only know it's equipped with a Vulcan cannon, a laser, and a railgun. It's all... A railgun, you said? Yeah. It uses magnets to fire bullets at extremely high velocities. Like, the technology was originally God, developed all. for the SDI system, but they were scrapped. We were successful in miniaturizing it in a joint venture between Arms Tech and Rivermore National Labs. The railgun is on Rex's right arm. Metal Gear's main function is to launch nuclear missiles. You sure you're not forgetting something? It's true that Metal Gear has a missile module on his back that can carry up to eight missiles, but are you saying it was originally meant to carry nuclear missiles? To kill the end, the T-Rex part, or you gotta shoot him? What, we're at the end, or? Yeah, but that's not all, I think. If Metal Gear Mario and Yoshi top right, missiles, check it out. already have all the practical data they need. It's no. a Nintendo game. Could it be? That's crazy. There. Metal Gear's co-developer, Rivermore National Labs, was working on a new type of nuclear weapon. They were using Nova and NIF laser nuclear fusion <laughs> testing equipment and supercomputers. So they developed a new type of nuclear weapon in a VR testing lab, huh? Yes, but you can't use virtual data on a battlefield. They would need actual launch data. These are some of the supercomputers. If you link these, you can test everything in a virtual environment. But it's all just theoretical. So, 
This exercise was designed to test the real thing. What did our president do? If the terrorists launch that thing? Strange. I'm a little nervous. 